So we're gonna do uh, intake, blow valve, and intercooler, upper intercooler piping install today. We just wanna show you the setup he has now and how it sounds compared to the new setup and how that one sounds. So I'm gonna go outside and just get some some noise clips for you guys. And right now, right now my current setup is uh, Canon Typhoon kit. So it's basically a Canon air filter and a Canon upper air cooler pipe with the Turbo Smart logo. Yeah, I'm, I'm a, I just open the hood for them real quick. I'm gonna get a quick video so you can see how that looks. Closer so you guys could hear it. This car is catalyst, so it's pretty loud. So you hear the intake. of you guys have been a little confused on if it was the same evo as the first video or the second video and if what mods are on each car well let's just get it cleared um this is my evo x and this one is my friends right here that's his evo x they're both white so it is kind of confusing just wanted to clear that up and also um we're gonna be doing the install, so we are getting the parts ready. Have the um, intercooler pipe with all the coupling and stuff. We have the blow off valve right here and the colder intake kit. All right, so we're about to start um, by just taking off this plastic piece and then we're gonna get those two clips out the way and uh, we're gonna start taking this out first. You're just gonna get all this out of the way so you can take the intake off. <laughs> Big turbo coming? Look at that. Maybe soon. Maybe not. Well you're gonna get a big turbo, you might as might as well get the the built, you know, block and, and built head. <laughs> Yeah, but I think I'm gonna just stock up all the parts and just throw it in once and then go get it tuned and that's it. But I'm trying to buy another Morning. car. I'm trying to buy another car too before. This vehicle, this car is equipped with remote control engine starting device. Check with the Wait, so you got a remote starter? What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Front part, that's the oh, okay, so, yeah. so you get the whole pipe in there, it's nice. <laughs> Firmly grasp it. Firmly grasp it. There you go. What you do? I just broke it loose. Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, damn, I don't have to loosen that shit. Oh, damn. You can, you can fit in there? Yeah, but that's... 
gotta. Yeah, I should have brought more tools though. Okay. Yeah, it's, I forgot. Like I forgot. I, need more I needed to bring tools in general. Mm -hmm. You know what? Just trade a car and get, get another one. Just trade another. One. Yeah, she was in front. All right, I'm gonna I'm just fast forward to the part. <laughs> oh, you guys peeped the. Nobody saw that. Ah, <laughs> uh, do a strong ass motherfucker broke a, a little boat with a quarter inch size ratchet. Like, you know how much torque this motherfucker makes? <laughs> At least like 300 to to the arm, you know? <laughs> Yeah. That shit was rusted as fuck. Uh, I mean, you got new, you got new stuff, yeah, right? Yeah, I got new shit, so it doesn't matter. But <laughs> I, mean, I still gotta get that shit. Oh, we're gonna, we're gonna get it out. All right, see. Look at that shit. You gotta, you gotta think of different ways to do different things. As long as it works. It's moving. take this one out because this one's broken so I'm just gonna actually I just need to take this this one out right yes yeah, what I'm saying you just gotta take that eight. that look like an eight possibly seven a little bit kind of close to the, you know the man you got lotion nope well actually I do but I don't really use it because I don't alright I'll use it <laughs> alright you gotta take my lotion then I guess where are your lotion uh, it's in my car wait you want to put it out now I be dropping shit here and there. So I think his new pipe is chrome, which is gonna look nice because they'll match his um his rims. Uh, we'll take a, a look after, see how everything comes out. Smart. Got the thousand cc's injectors. I thought you were talking about this one. Oh, that one, that one's like an eight. But just use your screwdriver. Okay, they all have the little things. Right. <clears throat> so right now, this hose is just a bitch to get out. Yeah, if it ever gets like frozen on the thing, even like if the clamp is off and it doesn't want to twist, just kind of use a pick. Just be careful not to poke the hose. Just grab it and kind of like get around the edges until it freezes up. And then it should twist and come off. This just has a lot of like corrosion and shit. That should tie this up. So uh, all we did was um, to summarize this, took this um, sensor out right here. We disconnected this hose, disconnected the blow valve um, vacuum line. There's two fittings on here with two different hoses um, that we, on this um, setup that we disconnected as well. And then there's a 10 millimeter down there that connects straight to the turbo inlet. And all you gotta do is kind of just wiggle it like that and it should just come out. And uh, now we're gonna get ready to set up the new setup. So we already have the coupling on the new intake um, pipe so we're just putting it on the turbo inlet side just make sure it's snug and turn it so it gets tight <coughs> old stuff 
new stuff. So we need to get, <laughs> let, me, let me see it, let me see it. So we need to swap out this um, little fitting from this one. We already took the old one out, which was that one. It was too small for the hose. So, so my boy's gonna need some lubricant because you know, you can't put it in dry. It just, it won't go in, it's too tight. But, go ahead, put some of that Blistex in it. We got nothing else right now. <laughs> yeah, you got that moisturizer. All right, all right, let's see if this works out, okay. Some, you gotta get some thrusting in here. Look, hold, hold this real quick. And give me more lube. That shit dry already. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, perfect. Alright. Yeah, that's a little hole though. <laughs> Put it in the hole, it is nice and tight, not moving nowhere. So we just gotta put that hose back on, the other hose back on, and then we'll continue the video from there. All right, guys, so we already um, put the hose on, tighten that flange down. Um, we already started putting the cover back on for the intake. And now after this, we should put the sensor on, the intake on, the blow valve with that hose that connects down there. And then we'll finish off with the upper end of the quarter pipe right here. All right, so we already installed the intake completely and the uh, bracket right here. So we started with the blow off valve pipe down there. Working our way up, blow valve is already on. I mean, it's installed inside the inside the pipe, but we need to get this bracket. I'm just trying to get this 10 millimeter bolt that goes onto onto one of the the lines and it holds that in place. And I already started working on this. There's two there's two there's two clamps right there. Loosen those up. Take the old one off, put this one back on. This is the AMS one, so we gotta put this 12 millimeter right here. And after he's done with that, we're gonna put this second pipe all the way up to here, and we should be good to go. All right, so we have upper and cooler pipe installed, the blow valve installed with the pipe kit, AMS intake installed all the lines are hooked up back in line so now what we're gonna do we're just gonna um, put the cover back on clean up some tools everything all right it's all installed back together so we're just gonna do the first start up with the car make sure you double check all your you know couplers Just to, to really hear it out. I think it's a lot louder than the other one though. Because I could definitely hear it a lot more than last time he was here. Alright, let's just go see if he can rev it up. Just park there. Are 
Show me your hair real quick, let's see. Check on your leg. No, 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 no. My girl just texted me. What'd he say? She said, it's not okay that I can hear you. Okay. <laughs> Yo, but, but she lives like five streets from here. Like. No, she lives on the other side. Oh, alright. But, um, yeah, just read one more time and then we'll go, we'll go to the, to the spot. You know what I'm talking about. Sounds pretty good though. 